a full-time job in the ghetto. Believe me, everything happened from crackheads selling food stamps to what you imagine. Kidnapping, purse snatching, balling, fashion. Sometimes you wake up in the morning knowing something wonderful is going to happen. Most of the time, it don't. Why'd you ride the train? Your dad's van broke? Nah, he had an early delivery in the city. Here. Cocoa bread. My dad, he makes it all the time. I'm sick of it. You know, substitute teaching is usually what folks do before they get a real career. Smith and McLaren, huh? <laughs> oh, we don't usually get your career corporate types like you into sub. Well, here now. Our kids need the basics. Reading, writing, arithmetic, anything extra is just that. Extra. No colors, Miguel. You know that. Uh, this is Dean Edmonds. He's our guidance counselor. He's a good man. Helps keep the staff sane, too. How did you know that was a colors thing? Uh, maybe his mom just gave him a hat to wear. Well, then his mom can come by my office after 3 o'clock and pick it up. Uh, Rules, Mr. Mason. Rules. That's what makes this place work. You bend one, you might as well kickbox them all. Ah, room 203. Welcome to the fourth grade. Fourth grade? I, I was told it's going to be teaching sixth grade, you know, older kids. You know, I, I prepared for Ender's game. Fraction, social studies. Yeah, and I taught romance languages, and look at me. Yeah, I know, but see, I, I, look, I don't think this I... in corporate America, Mason, you don't get to choose. Now, my fourth grade teacher broke her foot, and her class is what you got. Just stick with the lesson plans. Billy B, that is your third pair of new Nikes you've worn this month. Are you boosting right? again, son? He pulled out a magnum and blam! He misses. How did you know what kind of gun it was? Because I saw it while everybody else at the dirt. You were already there. <laughs> Come on, y'all, don't listen to her. We all know she dopey. Not as dopey as you, but breath. But breath this. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. That's enough, that's enough. We all know Kenya's mama's dopey, My too. My name is Kenya's Richard mama's Mason. Mason and I'm... Stop it! <laughs> Sit down! <laughs> Good morning. My name is Richard Mason. I'm going to be working with you until... Mrs. Downey returns. Please answer when I call out your name. Renee Sosa. Here. Thank you, Renee. Jimmy Washington. That book thing was whack. <laughs> Kenya Russell. That's me. Sorry I was acting now. I'm not usually that way. Well, that's good to hear. Michelle Dupre. Michelle, has anyone seen Michelle? Do we know if she's here? That's him right there. Michelle's a boy, a boy with a girl's name. Back off. My name's MD and it's French, stupid. Michelle, Michelle, ooh la la. All right, Mr. Washington, thank you. That'll be enough. All right, let's continue with the roll call here. Angelina Pettifor. Aren't you too old to be doing this? <laughs> Nicholas Jeter. Here. The. L light was all, all already 
already won. Already on, stupid. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Hey, no name call. Go ahead, Jimmy, finish reading. I'm done. No, go ahead and finish the end of the paragraph. I said I'm done, I Koki. <laughs> My name is Richard Mason. Actually, Mr. Mason. Cool, Kobe. <laughs> Sit down, Mr. Washington. Okie dokie, Koki. Yeah, what, what is with this Koki business? I've told you my name. It's those glasses, man. They're as thick as the old time cola bottle. It's like your head is on an antique road show. <laughs> all right, all right, that's enough. Uh-oh. Hello? Can I help you? Nope. This is my brother, Mr. Mason. His name is Dawson. I'm in kindergarten. Well, Dawson, uh, it's very nice that you're visiting your sister here, but we're in the middle of a lesson. Shouldn't you be back in your uh, kindergarten class? Nope. Dawson's in morning session. His class is over for today. He's staying here with me. In here? Well, where else are you going to go? All right. Um, but Dawson? I want you to be very quiet, all right? Okay. All right, who, who's, uh, who's next? All right, very good, uh, MD. You should have seen it, there are like 25 kids, one pain in the butt, and a five-year-old. Can't believe I'm teaching the fourth grade. I can't believe you're teaching any grade at all. Why, I went to school. Don't, don't play with your food. Well, what else am I supposed to do with it? Try eating it. I went to school for journalism, but you don't see me out chasing news stories. I bet you want to. My point is we were all idealistic, right? Reality changes things. Dad, Tim's father said you got fired because you're a whistleblower. I got laid off, Darren, because I did the right thing. It's not what Tim's dad said. I don't care what Tim's dad said. So what, we're going to be poor now? Can I be excused? Thanks for the support. I told you to keep a window open when you do this. I like that one. So how's softball coming? It's baseball. All right, baseball. You want to tell me what's going on with you, Darren? I'm thinking we need to spend time together. There, I really want to see you play. Come on, Darren. You know, before I got off at 9 o'clock, now with this teaching thing, I, I'm home by 3, 3.15. I, I really want to see you play. I really do. Season starts next month, corner of Cecil and Maine. Thank you. You've got 11 games. You missed all of them last year. What are you doing? These glasses make my eyes look like I'm wearing Coke bottles. Well, I have been trying to get you to wear contact lenses for years. Yeah, but I didn't know they made my eyes look Cokey. Cokey? Who said you looked cokey? Smart ass in my class. He was right. Really? Figure it out yet? Hey. Give me a second, would you? Jeez. Yeah. D3 taking C4. H3 to H2. Hey, Rich, do me a favor. Could you at least pretend to look at the board when we play? Hey, these are new. <laughs> Bishop H7, D3. Pawn to H1. Give me my queen back. You know, believe it or not, I'm going to miss these little morning humiliations. Yeah, well, now that I'm a teacher, I get out at 3, I can always humiliate you in the afternoon. Yeah, speaking of which, what did your wife say about the new gig? She thinks I'm having a midlife crisis. What do you think? I don't know. Maybe I am. South Bronx, huh? 
<laughs> what? What? Well, it's not exactly your neck of the woods now, is it? Hey, hurry up. I don't want to be late. Yeah, OK, we'll finish the game. Uh, king, c5 to b4. <laughs> Queen to c1. Rest of force moves. You move there, I move here. Checkmate. See ya. Oh, hey! Don't forget about the demo in the park this weekend. Two times 42. Easy. Renee? I can't do that. Miss Donnie only took us as far as two times 20. Well, the process is the same, Renee. The answer will be different, of course, but... You know the answer? Do I? Yes, I do. Then why are you asking me? Come here. <laughs> Zero? How'd you get zero out of that? Mrs. Donnie said any answer beat no answer at all. Yeah, but you didn't even try, Renee. I did try. I ain't stupid. Of course you're not. I, I didn't mean that. Tell you what. Come here. I'm going to show you how to do it. Come on. This will be fun. Here. You know how to do two times two, right? All right, so you do first the two times two. Uh, Mr. Mason? Yeah. I uh, need a moment with you. Um, all right, uh, well, Continue going over your timetables. Oh, yes. All right. Is this your teacher, honey? Yeah? All right, you go on in then. You all right? What's going on? Do you understand? We did a bust at a crack den this morning, and that little girl was there trying to get her mother out. You're kidding. Yeah, it's not the first time. Her mom's what we call a regular. If it weren't for the grandma, that kid'd be placed with social services. Well, um, why are you telling me this? We're here as our own kind of uh, social services. We see firsthand what a lot of these kids have to deal with. But kids like her are still workable. They haven't turned yet. Turned? Turned angry, turned bad. I'll tell you what you do. Go check out our neighborhood when you get the chance. You do a little extra, and we get to do a whole lot less. Thank you. Have yourself a good day. Take care. Yeah, you too. Anybody? Come on, somebody's gonna be able to know this. You want, Peach? It's a big bad world out here, Shorty. Who you with, man? I ain't with nobody. That needs to change, Shorty. That needs to change right now. Says who? Says who? You got ice in your blood, Shorty. Yeah, I like that. Man, listen, man. Listen. I'm doing you a solid, man. I know your business, man. You ain't got no backup out here. You ain't got no protection, dog. You roll with us, you get to keep your teeth, man. Plus some new air nights you wear. Yeah. So what's it gonna be, Ice? All right, what I gotta do? Mr. Washington, you wanna join the rest of the class and write these words down, please? Oh, well, I did. You feel like getting an education? Not really. Look, son. I'm not your son. My daddy's dead and you ain't no kin to me. Well, I'm very sorry to hear about your daddy. I really am. You know, but you are here to learn, Jimmy. You are here to get an education. Yeah? What am I going to do with it?
So how was your first week at school? <laughs> I'm so in the mood for mass destruction. Well, my friend, you came to the right place. Shall we? Yeah, let's do this. Folks ready to see some chess? Professor, whenever you're ready. Good luck. Players, please, don't move until he gets back to your board. Morning. Good luck. Hi. Morning. Hey. What's up? What's up, guys? Looking for a bike. You got a bike? What kind of bike? I don't know. What you got, man? Oh, you want a street bike? Mountain bike? I see it, man. I got something just came in new. Right here. Look at this. Hey. Good day. This. Is the best on the market right That's now. That's nice. Huh? Custom AC. Yeah, yeah, the gears are awesome. Man. Check this out right here. Put your hands on that. Yeah, you like that? The tires are awesome. Like that. Nice. Oh, check these grips and rods. Hey, hey stop it! Stop that kid! That's not a good move. That's going to be mate in three. Why don't you take that back? I'll be back. What's going on? Dude over there is kicking 14 butts at once. No way. Hey, I know him. Hey, Koki! That's mate too, actually. Yeah, good guy, good guy. Mm. What are you doing here? What? You can't come downtown? Yeah, that's checkmate. <laughs> nice game. Nice. That's uh, checkmate. Great game. Wow, did you just whoop him? Yes, I, I did. How's it work? I'm kind of busy right now, Jimmy. Why, why don't you go uh, sit down? I'll, I'll tell you about it in a minute, all right? Come on, man. Ah, Arnie, help me. You're on your own, pal. It's a war, all right? You know, each piece has a, a certain way that it can fight, and uh, if somebody grabs your king, you're dead, all right? Get it? So it's like we're in the army. It's better than that. We are the army. That is checkmate. Nice game. Nice game. I'm sorry. We, uh, we're a very specialized army, and our, our, our job is to stay alive and take down the other king. Survival and victory. Man. Who is this guy? One dude beating all y'all? My hamster got more hands. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Seriously, that's rude. Go on, let's go. Uh, you know, I misled you. That, that is checkmate. You're incredible. All right. That's it. Ooh. 14 yeah. players in 18 you. minutes. Not bad, huh? I want to thank you all for coming out. That ends our annual chess demonstration. Now, if you'd like to sign up for the chess league, just head over to that tent over there. Marcy will take care of you. Thanks again for coming out. It's been a beautiful afternoon, folks. I'm gonna play you again. You got it. Okay. Looks like you got yourself a convert.
Suppose I told you kids you could rule the world, your own chunk of the world. I'd say you've been smoking an illegal substance. Then I'd call the cops. Yeah, well, don't call them quite yet. Ladies and gentlemen, behold your world. It's kind of flat. Word. Somebody call Columbus. I'm going to teach you guys how to play the great game of chess. Come here. Come on. Hurry up. Let's go. This is the battlefield where kings and queens play. Can anyone tell me how many squares there are here? Anybody? Um, 64. 64. Ooh. Hmm. You sure? Yeah. That's what I counted, too. Well, what about these four squares right here? Don't they make a square as well? Or what about the board itself? Isn't that a square? Huh? Right. At least our world's got horses in it. Yeah, those, Renee, are called knights. And they're very, very tricky because they move in an L shape like this and attack from the side when nobody's looking. Pow. Like Jackie Chan in the movies. You can't see him, but bam, there he is. Yeah, yeah, sort of like that. Hey, Jimmy, you want to do me a favor and uh, help me set up the pieces here? Yeah. Um, what's this one? That's the queen. Now, she is both deadly and beautiful. She's the most powerful piece on the board. I like that. <laughs> Go ahead, sister. Right on, Miss Fine. Yeah, the only problem is everyone's always trying to kill her. Well, you know it. <laughs> you say rule the world, but I don't see nothing worth ruling. Well, the world you'll rule is in here, Renee. In your head? No, no, in your head. See, everything starts with how you think, right? I mean, playing chess is like taking your brain to the gym. You get that brain muscle all pumped up, nobody and nothing can defeat you. Yeah, sure. If you can win a game of chess, nobody can call you stupid. For real? Yeah, for real. I'm in. <laughs> Yo, I seen teach be 14 people at once. Open the gym, I want to get my brain ripped. Show us how to play. Right now? Yeah. Yeah. So don't you think we ought to be doing no. this? No, 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 my queen's gonna kick your king's ass. Not if my pony chase you back in your castle. It's not a pony, it's a knight. It's a rook, not a castle. And what's this bubble-headed one? Uh, well, that's your bishop. Now, that's a very quiet, sneaky guy. You know, he travels fast and moves on a slant. This piece right here, that's the king. That's the most important piece on the board. It can only move, though, one square at a time. Dang. Everybody else moves in circles around me. Weak. Need to learn to fend for herself. Maybe he's like Big Daddy H and I C. You know, telling everybody else what to do. H and I C. Head nigga in charge. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, right, right. That was good. That was good. I not get. What are all these little guys with the round heads? Look like they all got candles on. These are pawns. Yeah, you send these out to do the dirty work. Some people think they're dispensable. That uh, they'll do what they're told. You know, but if they get cream. Nobody cares whether you lose them or not. Uh, actually, you know, the, the pawn is the bravest piece on the board. You know, I mean, it, it may look small and weak, but the truth is the pawn fears nothing. Let's review now. Tell me how this piece moves. Anybody who has oh, this? Oh, I know, I know right, what it right, moves. Go ahead. It goes in. Tony, you, you gotta see these kids. I feel like I have. You haven't stopped talking about them since you got in here, you know that? I've never seen kids play chess like this before. I mean, they, they get it. They get the passion of it. They get the science. And they, they never even heard of chess before this. You know, you're starting to sound like a guy who's not on a simple in-and-out goodwill mission anymore, you know that? What do you mean? Well, correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't you say that this teaching thing was just for the short term? Sounding to me like you're thinking you might want to stay on. I don't know what I want to do. I mean, 
Substitute teachers get paid squat. I got family, I got bills. But? <laughs> I don't know. I think you do. I want everyone to focus and pay attention. It's a good way to learn. Okay, you're first. What are you gonna do? That's a great move. King's Pond moving up two spaces. That's a wonderful opening. What are you gonna do, Jimmy? Can I do the same thing? Yeah, do the same thing. That's actually the move you should make. See, you've blocked her ponds coming any further. That's fantastic. What are you gonna do? Focus, you guys. I want everyone watching. All right, well, that's an interesting move. It's a little dangerous, because your king's out there where everyone's gonna attack him. I'm gonna show him he's not weak. Well, you certainly did that. All right, what are you gonna do? You guys listening? Yeah. No, no, you're gonna have to find a piece that can hop over, because this is uh, blocked by a pawn. How else? This one. That's a great move. See, see, that's the perfect thing about a knight. See, you can hop over things, and now you're attacking this piece. So how do you protect that piece? No, no, you can't move backwards at the pawn. Everybody, you can only move forward at the pawn. Man, it sucks. Well, there have been chess rules for hundreds of years. If you're not following the rules, you're not playing chess. That still sucks. Good news is your opponents have to play by the same rules. Now, that's a great move. So you just protected that pawn. All right, what are you going to do? Keep going. I want to hang this up. That's a good move, getting that king back there. All right, this is going to be our practice board, you guys, so everyone can see what's going on. Mr. Mason? Hey, guys, guys, get in your seats. Go on. Oh. Hurry up. Hurry up. I think it's time for math, isn't it? Can we finish playing our game? I'm trashing them. All right, go on, sit down, quick. Go on, hurry up, sit down. All right. Uh, all right, who wants to uh, come up and try these? Can we play when we're done? Well, let's see how this goes, all right? Uh, can you come on up here? Brittany, uh, Jimmy, I want to see you up here. Come on, Jimmy. This one? Yeah. Great, very good, all right, 24, 28, that's great. Let's focus, let's focus, you can do this. Just relax your mind now. You know what? Think about the chessboard. You know how every piece has a certain way it moves? Well, every number has a certain way it operates. What? Just go look at the board. Check it out. You can do this. I too. <laughs> That's great. That's fantastic. Hey, you want to tell us how you got that? Well, it's easy. That eight squares in a row, two rows to 16 squares. So four with that is 15. That's fantastic. Good for you, Jimmy. Go sit down. That was great. That was great, Jimmy. Interesting tactics, Mason. Uh, tricks, however, have a short educational shelf life. I bet that by tomorrow, these kids will have forgotten that Jess even exists. Yeah, she's not a trick, Just stick to your lesson plan. We're going to have to continue this on our own time. Who wants to come in early tomorrow? I, that's great. Raise your hand for me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Is that a yes? Yes. All right. Uh, tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. Look, Mr. M, work on an open file. But you can't do that. Can't so, right, teach? Yeah, I'm afraid you can, can you? So then. And get ready, because I'm going to whoop your butt. Yeah? Bishop takes C3. 
I'ma ruin your skinny pony, no plan ass. So bring it. Be the sick. Yeah, you can run bubble head, but you sure can't hide. Oh, 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 calm down, calm down. Hey, chill out. Chess is a mind game, remember? Your mouth has nothing to do with it. You know, at chess tournaments, kids play for hours on end without saying a single word to each other. Tournaments? Yeah, tournaments. Kids do tournaments? You mean like soccer or basketball matches, only it's chess? Uh-huh, exactly like that. You know something, I wish you guys could see it. Absolutely amazing. They're like hundreds of kids from different schools and teams paired off against each other. The room is filled with people just watching every move they make. You can hear a pin drop, it is so quiet. It's like you can, you can feel the players plotting how to destroy each other. There's so much tension, it feels like you're waiting for a bomb to explode. Cool. It really is cool. Do they win stuff? Do they win stuff? Yeah, yeah, sure. They play for uh, trophies. They uh, sometimes cash prizes, even scholarships. Scholarships? Yeah. <laughs> like, like the kind that send you to college? Exactly. Reality check, Mr. M. You saying that kids, any kids, even kids like us can play in this thing? Actually, there's more than one thing. They got competitions all the time. I think there's one next month, as a matter of fact. Wait a second here. Are you guys interested in doing something like this? Yeah! yeah. Really? Well, I'll have to think about that. It's gonna mean a lot of extra work. If you think you could scare us off with that, think again, man. I like your attitude, MD. All right, chess team homework. Pass these down. I want to see three games played, both sides, folks. I want you to log in each move on the back in pencil. Now, I'm going to give you spelling words, and I'm going to give the rest of the class later. I want you to be prepared to use each word in a sentence describing why you moved where you moved. Can I play, too? Yeah, of course you can, man. Cool. I'm not kidding. No homework, no tournament. First word. Imagine. Second word. Imagine. Prepare. Imagine if I eat. could go to Third college. Word. No. Imagine that all my pawns turned into queens. And I went scholarships to every college in the world. And I go one year to Harvard, then one year to, um, Duke, then one year someplace in New York. Kenya. Kenya, come. Yes, Mama? Go to the store and get Mama some soda. Now? But I'm doing my homework. Larry, give her the goddamn money. Larry, give her the goddamn money. Larry, give her the goddamn money. And don't stop by your grandma's place. You heard I don't want that bitch knowing my business. I can't believe how hard these kids are working. Mm. You know, the tournament is a good idea. But you're gonna have to be careful. These kids don't get out of this neighborhood very much. No, this group can go anywhere. They're tough. Gene, mm. you sick? You want me to call a doctor? <laughs> Eat up the food, Naman. <laughs> Lucia, this is Richard Mason, Michelle's new teacher. Yes, teacher. Respect. Michelle put one foot out of line, you see, man? Tell me. I will knock it right back in. <laughs> no, no, Michelle's a good kid. And, I, you know, he's getting really good at chess, too. Chess? Begin? Yeah. All the kids are starting to learn. My son don't have time for games. When him graduate medical school, when him is a, a big, big doctor, Dr. Michelle, then maybe, maybe we'll have time for games. All right, everybody with permission slips for the Plymouth tournament, bring them on up. Hurry up, come on. Jimmy? Jimmy Washington? Has anyone seen Jimmy? No, Mr. M. I haven't seen him.
Yo, son, come here, son. Leave me hanging at the bike shop like that, bro. Huh? Son, gonna let that fly? You gonna get it right now, bro. Come on, this way. You didn't realize you're stealing, bro. Huh? You didn't realize who you're stealing, bro. Somebody beat the hell out of that kid, and he just sits there silent. Oh, but he did ask for you. Thank you. Hey, you all right? You want to talk to me about it? Jimmy? Baby, who did this to you? Do you know? How could you people let this happen? Mrs. Washington, it happened off school property. Oh, and once they're off your precious watch, nobody cares, right? This is a baby, mister, a child. I know that, ma'am. That's why I walked him home. Come on in. Slam the door. Nothing to drink but OJ. Oh, water's fine for me. Yeah. Are you surprised he won't tell you who jumped him? Not really. Jimmy's been keeping secrets lately. He's just having a response, I guess, since his daddy went to jail. His daddy's not dead? No, his daddy's not dead. His daddy's just in prison. Cokie's serving six to nine. You all right? I'm sorry. I got a lot on my mind. You want to talk about it? It's these kids. I don't know. It's like I'm beginning to feel like for the first time in my life, I'm... Just hear me out. Suppose there's a way that I could do this full time. Full time? Yeah. Richard? We could be happier in a smaller house. Oh. Fewer cars, couldn't we? Oh, and, and while we're at it, let's just let Darren's teeth fall out, too. That's not fair. I, I, I'm not talking about that. Well, what are you talking about? I don't want to downsize. I don't, I don't want to change. Oh, oh, slow down, slow down. Listen, I want you guys to stay to Come here. I want you to stay together as a group, all right? Two by two people, we're gonna walk in quickly and quietly. We know Do how this. to act, Mr. Richard. Walk in, be polite. No talking during the tournament. Shake the loser's hands after it's done. All right, let's go. The loser's hands. Oh, we're gonna win, Mr. Richard. We're gonna be nice and polite, but we're gonna keep the natural ass the fulfillment crew. Yeah! Shh, yeah. hey, hey, what did I just say? Why do you think they're staring at us? Probably her with that killer chest. What are those things on the table? Oh, yeah. All right, listen up. I probably should have told you about those are, uh, those are chess clocks, OK? After every move, you hear me? After every move, you punch the clock. Move, punch the clock. It's no big deal. How come our class ain't got them? Because, uh, look, we couldn't afford them, can you? We have what we need, all right? It's not about what you have. It's about the game you bring. So don't worry, just focus on the game. Everybody, look. This is tight. Oh, I need to get one of these on my coffee table. Dude, you got no coffee table. I'm going to give this one to my mom. Yo, Miss M, do we get to take trophies home with us today? Yeah, well, first you're going to have to win them. Don't, don't, don't touch us. Put those down, OK? 
Okay, listen to me. Each of you are going to play two matches, all right? Who are we playing, man? <laughs> well, as a matter of fact, there you go right there. What? Who are we playing, black kid? Dawson? Man, they got gear. They got everything. Why didn't you tell us we were playing against a bunch of rich kids? Because it doesn't make any difference. Man, what plan are you on? Hey, come here, come here. Listen, listen, listen. Chess is about the mind, how you think. It's not about what you look like or how you dress. Okay, the mind makes chess a level playing field. You're all equals here. You gotta remember that, okay? Man, we don't even have a name. Well, the tournament's about to start. Would all parents and coaches please leave the competition area? Okay, good luck. No, 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 no don't, don't leave, don't leave. Listen, don't listen, listen to me. All that matters is that you do your best. I mean that. You're gonna be fine. Now go on, remember the order? Go ahead, go on. Would all parents and coaches please leave the competition area? Start your clocks. Kid is yours. Oh, um, all the black and Puerto Rican ones. your best. That's all this is about. Come on, when you saw me at the clues, the jacket, Shh. my guy even had a chess club with watch on. What your guy had was more knowledge of the game. The more you play, the better you get. It's that simple. Man, it's not that simple. When, when, when what? Jimmy, chess doesn't care if you're poor and from the Bronx or black or Puerto Rican, or even if your daddy's in prison. Checkmate.
elementary novice? Whoever heard of getting a ninth place trophy? It's better than any trophy you bought in. Shut up, you won't even there. I'll be there next time. Ain't gonna be no next time. Well, you just gonna quit, just like that? Dawson, hop on down, will you? Hey, look, losing never feels good. But losing a game is actually one of the best things that can happen to a chess player. The best? That's whack. Not at all, sport. Any chess player worth his salt will tell you a loss is nothing but an opportunity. An opportunity to get better and learn something. What were your mistakes? What did your opponent see that you missed? How did they exploit your weaknesses? Do you answer those questions for yourself, and I guarantee you next time you'll be a stronger player. Who are you? I asked Arnie to come in today and help us analyze our strengths and our weaknesses. What happened to you? I was attacked by a pack of wild dogs. Thank you, Arnie. Can we focus, please? We have a tournament in three weeks. We want to bring home more trophies. We're going to have to work at it. Yeah, listen up, guys. See this? These are the games you played, your moves and your opponents. I want you to study these, and I want you to tell me why you think you lost. Well, I already know what I lost. Why is that? It was that gold chain with the stones on it. I'm thinking, why can't I have that sparkly necklace? It must have cost $300. The next thing I knew, her and the bling jumped me. So you let yourself get distracted. You let something unrelated pull you out of your game. I guess. Me too. I was distracted by being all around the micas. Man, I had the clothes, the jackets. Yeah, all right, all right, all right, all right. Hey, guys, you let the environment of the room take over the environment of your mind. Now, we've talked Rich, about can yeah. I say something? Look, guys, I know what it's like to feel different. But this game, it's not about the color of your skin. It's not about whether or not you can walk. It's certainly not about how much money you got in your pocket. It's about what you got up here and in here, and that's it. So, guys, what happened? I guess he was better than me. What'd you just say? He was better than me. He played better than me, and he won. All right. Okay, see what Jimmy just said? It's the first step in learning how to win. Hey, little man. You won a trophy. What kind of game did you bring? Ninjas. I brought my ninjas. What do you mean, Dawson? Ninjas. All of my pieces got ninja names. All got ninja faces. When I'm stuck in a move, I see my ninjas come to life. So you just imagined? No, it's real. It's always real. I call them and they come and let them tell me what to do. Excuse my bro, he's got ninjas on his brain. You ought to see his room. He thinks I'm he's a ninja in... warrior. When I play chess, that's who I am. Hey, Dawson, you know, when I play, I'm Michael Jordan. It's true. Check this big old chair at the door, and when I sit down at that table, I feel strong, powerful, like nothing can stop me. So when I play, I play to win. And when you lose? Study my mistakes, fix them, come back stronger. OK, guys, we got a mission. We have a tournament in three weeks. And we're going to have to work between now and then every day, before school and even after school. And guys, you're going to have to, each one of you, find your ninja, your secret warrior, you know, the one that lives inside your heart. You guys have to look inside you at that thing that scares you. Because inside what scares you is what saves you every time. Find it, name it, teach it how to play chess. OK, all right, let's get to work. Jimmy. Renee. teaching the kids chess on my time, ignoring the set lesson plan, well, and getting better test results than I've ever seen. The kids are doing better in every subject overall. Whatever you're doing in there, I'd like you to keep it up permanently.
I don't want to fight about no, this. No, no way, no way, honey. You're it's not, not gonna work. You're not even listening to me. No, I don't want to hear Can this anymore, Richard. Can we just talk Richard. calmly, please? My brother called today. There is a job opening up in his sector, a corporate job with corporate pay and benefits. Now, you look around this house and at these bills and tell me which job you need to take. Oh, sorry. All right, all right. Okay. Um, yes, yes. Hold, hold on, please. Hold on. It's a woman. She sounds very, very upset. Hello? Put him on the couch. Did he say anything to you at the hospital? Not a word. After two broken ribs, a sprained arm? What could be scaring him so bad he won't even tell me about it? Maybe, um, maybe he was trying to protect you. Boys do that, protect their mothers, or think that they can. This is Koki's fault. If Koki were here, he'd be able to protect me, and Jimmy could just be a kid. Was he close with his daddy? They were like this. Has he visited him in prison? He won't go. He was so tiny when Koki got sent up. I think it broke his heart. Jimmy just adores you. Because of me. <laughs> you know, you and this chess thing are all he talks about. It's like he thinks he can save the world by playing a game of chess. You need to take that job. I told you, it starts in two weeks. Not that job. The man back there in that room with that woman and her son. I haven't seen him since we got married. I've missed him, Richard. So... How far down are we downsizing? <laughs> I love you. Thank you. You all right? What if he don't come? Oh, he'll be here. They just have to, uh, you know, get him from his cell. It takes a few minutes. How do you know? I watch TV. Dad? Yeah, that's right. Take a good look at you, boy. Damn, your ass got big. Mm -mm. And you must be my son's teacher. Yes, I am. 
Well, why not I leave you two alone? Sit down, boy. I heard you've been getting yourself in trouble. We gonna talk about that. What's up with your hair? I cut it. One less thing to worry about in here. You know what I'm saying? Got something for you. You still like these? You still even when you was little. That's all right. Too much sugar in these things anyway. I like these, though. So you play football, basketball, like sports, things like that? I play chess. You play chess? You got chess? Yeah, I got chess. I get chess board. You want to play, sir? All right, I'll be right back. What happened? I thought Mr. Mason said you could play this game. I can't, all right? It's just that. It's just that what? Look at the board. Am I making moves you've never seen before? Huh? Oh, what, you mad? You mad? What, you mad? You, you mad because I've been in a joint for the last eight years? Is that why you mad? Learn how to play the game. When you get angry, people play you out of position. That's the same thing that happened to me. Instead of checking my feelings and looking at all my options, I got pissed off and I lost control. And that's how I ended up in here. Got to always stay three or four moves ahead. And you gotta keep your third eye open. That's your brain. You feeling me? So why is knight to d4 an unfortunate move? Because it opens up path for the rook to capture the queen. Not if the pawn intercedes her. Queen me. Well, what are you doing? Don't do that. But he's going to win anyway. Ain't no way to beat him. Yeah, you're right. You can't win, Renee. But you can make sure that he can't win either. How? Well, just keep checking him with your rook. You'll force him to stalemate you. He can't win, you can't lose. It's called a draw, and in competition, each win half a point. So don't ever, ever quit. All right, that's it, geography time. Dawson, go to kindergarten, quick, go on. Go on, go on now, scoot. We'll see you this afternoon. All right, who can tell me where Russia is? Yeah, Renee, go ahead, come on up. Here you go. Here, home of Gary Kasparov the world's greatest chess player. Very good. Sit down. All right, grab your seats. Let's go. Hurry up. All right, no matter what, fit, hey, listen to me. Finish each game. Nobody walks off this time, all right? Stay centered and stay cool. 
We need a name. What? 356 just doesn't sound right. We need a name now. All right, any suggestions? How about the Ninja Marauders? It's not a bad one. Let me do your glasses here. The chess champs. How about the way called Boogie Down the Shop Bombing? How about the Knights? There you go. You can call me a knight. MD, your daddy said expressly. So, is it Knights or what? I'm glad you're here. All right, what do you say? Knights? Sounds good to me. The Knights of the South Bronx. Sounds like a fairy tale. Well, let's go kick some fairy tale butt. Yeah. Knights, oh, yeah. let's do our duty. Players may now be seated. All right, let's, uh, let's give our new name a try here, all right? Ready? One, yeah. two, three. The Knights! All right. Focus and now, parents, focus. I want you to stay safe. Have level. a good game. Jimmy, stay cool. Players, start your clocks. They're good. Fast, too. What kind of clocks do you practice with? We don't have clocks. What, none of your coaches use clocks? Can't afford clocks or coaches. <laughs> You're kidding, right? This is the Bronx. We're lucky we got school books. Go uh, buy yourself some clocks. Kids deserve them. You know, you're aiding and abetting the competition. So bring it. That's very kind of you. Thank you very much. That little kid's amazing. I've never seen anything quite like this before. Is he yours? Actually, he's ours. You'd say that. Draw? Draw. I'm not sure, but I think we may have won. The competition winners are in first place, overall team points CES 356 from the Bronx. <laughs> No, no, uh, fourth grade teacher. We can't afford private coaches. Keep me posted, won't you? Can you believe it? You me. I can't wait to my mom. <laughs> so, what's next? The Nationals. <laughs> what is it? Curried oxtail. Ox as in the 
The ox that draws the cart? No, man, it's beef. But in the islands, we like to spice up the names on the dishes a little bit, you know? Lucian's my wife, Pat. You must be very proud. Proud? I'm talking about MD and the, the trophy he won. Trophy? Which, which trophy? Michelle. Michelle, come here right now. Where is this, this, this trophy you win? Why may not see it as yet? Because it's for chess, and you don't respect chess. You don't respect anything I think of you. Mm-hmm. I'm going to college, and I'm going to be both a doctor and a scientist. And I'm never coming back to the Bronx again. Until I can buy it and burn it all up. And this chess? They go and get you to college? Yes. They have scholarships to top schools, and I'm going to win one. I can't do it standing here busting tables. Chess is a game for thinking men, not for bus boys. Go and get the trophy. Attention, everyone. Attention. Find the trophy my boy win. It is a trophy for chess. Wow, that's pretty. Did you win that today? Leave it alone, okay? I mean, it's not like you can sell it for drugs or anything. Is that what you think of me? I think you get high. And when you do, nothing much matters to you. Except getting high again. See, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all youngsters out here, man. You want to make some money on the block? All right, all right, yeah. I'll show you the dice game right here. 456, man. That's all you need to do. One, two, three, you out. All right, feel all me? Right. You yeah. feel me? You yeah. can make a look. What's up? Just came to warn you. I saw my daddy in prison the other week. And uh, I told him about you. Derek and Cuba. He wasn't too happy. He made me tell a few his murderer friends about you. They'll be getting out in a week. And I gave him your address. Yeah. And you was wrong, see? I got back. OK, we've got the Nationals coming up in three weeks. We're going to have to work very, very hard for this. From now on, I don't want to see any practice mats, boards, sketches, nothing. Chess is a game that is played in the mind. And from now on, that's exactly where we're going to practice it. OK. Who wants to be first? Shove over. You're up. D2 to D4. I can't. Yeah, you can. Just think of the board. E7 to E6. Good. Pawn E2 to E4. Pawn D7 to D5. Knight G1 to F3. Knight G8 to F6. Great. On G2 to G4. Bishop C1 to E2. 
Castle to Kingston. Queen E3 to F3. Pawn A2 to A1. We playing in Queen. Gimme. All right, all right. Very good. All right, now I want you guys to uh, focus, focus. I want you to visualize um, some hot dogs and maybe some hamburgers, because you guys are coming over for a team barbecue at my house this afternoon. Yay! Good job. Really good. That was great. Great Thank focus. You, Mr. Mason. Parents gave permission for all the kids to come? Are you kidding? A teacher feeding their kids? You just hit a grand <laughs> slam. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Darren's got a game at 4 o'clock. What time is it? It's 3.30. So, check out this one. Oh, now that is fat. It's awesome. Can you do that with a name? Sure. What you got in mind? Mr. Mason! Yeah? Good news. We just got the applications for the Nationals. Ah! Oh, it's gonna be like doing my taxes. $75 registration fee per child. We've got five kids. Plus airfare to Dallas. Oh. Now we'll figure something out. Don't worry. All right, everyone, you know you're hungry. Come on and get it. Now, a pint of rice and peas, a Hobson, a kid, to Texas for the final. Come on. You know you're hungry. Jerk chicken, rice on peas. You know how we do it. You don't want to miss my food. Come, come on. Come. Well said there, Lucian. Hey, you know what? Go get your brother. Okay, With you. Dawson, I bet you we can get a live broadcast. Okay, listen, that lady right there, she wants to talk to you. Are you okay about talking about Dallas and raising money and everything? Mm-hmm. Okay, go ahead. Go and slide down and talk to her. Finding his way through the crowd is the one and only Dawson. What brings you out today? I'm just trying to raise some money to go to Dallas. This is a big move for your club. How do you think all your members are doing so far? I think they're doing good, because they, um, they only got... One person to check me, but I'm the first one to, to get the trophy. And how do you hold it up? Do you hold it up above your head? No, I just hold it up like this, so that way I don't hit myself in the, in the forehead. But I just hold it up like this, so everybody can see it. But sometimes I just say thank you, thank you. Crowd, but not spending too much. It's not enough, is it? Well, airfare, but not for fees in a hotel. I don't think we're gonna make this tournament, Nettie. Maybe we ought to tell the kids. No, later. Let them enjoy their picnic. They deserve it. I'm late. I had a job interview. I don't think I got it, but... Too bad for them. You look wonderful, Mommy. You think so? Even my hair. Your hair looks great. I baked a pound cake for the bake sale. Oh, it didn't turn out too good, though. It's more like half a pound. It looks perfect. You guys, I am so proud of you. You have worked so hard and so well. And I'm proud of your parents, too. But I gotta, I gotta level with you. This trip is very expensive. How expensive? 
Oh, hi. I thought I asked you to keep me posted. Oh, yes, you did, but... Uh... How much more money do you need, Mr. Mason? I'm not sure that I, um... Uh... How much? $4,000. Keep the change. Guys, not only are we going to the tournament, but we're going to eat really well. Yeah! Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. my pleasure. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. The battlefield is an awesome sight. A massive ballroom with seemingly endless rows of chessboards. The 2,400 kids take their places. Slow down, slow down. Come here, come here, come here. Let me talk to you for a second. Okay. This is it, you guys. All the best players in the country are here, and they all want to kick your butts. Listen to me, hey. I might have brought chess into your lives, but now you guys got to bring your lives into the game. You play from your secret hearts, and you're going to be just fine, okay? Richard? Richard? Hey. I don't, oh, my God, I don't believe you. Oh, thank you so much. Hey. What are you doing here? Got business, Dad. So, check out the goodies, dude. Oh, snap. This is time. The Knights of the South Bronx. Oh, look oh, at this that. This is pretty cool. I had no idea. It's my We're about to start. Parents and coaches, please leave the playing area. OK, you guys, OK, Players, sleep them on real quick. Go. You are about to begin the first of seven rounds. You know what, you guys, huddle up here for a second. I want to talk to you. OK, listen, the problem is you guys are playing scared. You got the best players in the country here, and you guys are so impressed, you're sitting there letting them just do anything they want with you. I mean, enough with that. You're treating your ninjas like they're house pets or something. Let them loose. Let them have some fun, all right? Now, this is a time for you to be brave, OK? I don't care about winning. Just get out there and bring the best game you've got, OK? You're about to play the best player from Boston. She's ranked second in your division. She favors the King's Gambit. Decline. Okay. You're going to be great. What's going on with you? Are you hungry or something? What do you want? No bottom jelly sandwich. I'll get you something in a second, all right? Now, let's not forget who we are. Come here. Play again, all right? What is her name? One, two, three. The Knight! The Knight! Players, this is round four of seven.
Hello. Remember me? Check me. Check. Bronx. Checkmate, Boston. Hey, you played a real good game. One game out of first place. Now we got Jimmy Dawson. See the whole game. Check me. Hi, I'm Doc. I'm in kindergarten. Nice game. The first place overall team trophy goes to a team who are first timers in this competition. We are very proud to give the first place national team trophy to the Knights of the South Bronx. Some days you wake up just knowing something wonderful will happen. Most of the time, it doesn't. But when it does, it does for real. Chess is a game that is played in the it's mind. It's not about the color of your skin, and it's certainly not about how much money you got in your pocket. G 
A to F6. Bishop C1 to E2. Castle to kingside. Queen E3 to F3. Pawn A2 to A1. Reclaiming queen. <laughs> <laughs>